Hi students, today we are going to learn angles and heat types. Let's learn about different types of angles. In your home, you can see the clock. In the clock that have two ants. The movement of that ants to make different kinds of angles. Now I explain. We take the two answers. Let us consider the two ants or the two rays. The distance between the two rays are called as an angle. Here the rays are called arms. The two arms intersecting at a point, that point is called vertex. The unit of angle is degrees. We can measure the angle with the help of an instrument, that instrument called as a protector. The protector you can see in your geometrical box. The protector have a midpoint that is called a central point. The angles are start from in a protector is 0 degree 2. It ends with a 180 degree. It looks like a semicircle. If it is a complete full rotation to become as a circle, that is 180 plus 180, 360 degree. That's why the angle of circle is 360 degree. The angles are start from 0 degree to 1 degree, 2 degree as a unit wise, the number wise, the numerically it will be increasing in an order. For example, let us consider 30 degree, 40 degree, 50 degree, 75 degree, 90 degree, 180 degree, 190 degree, 245 degree as like that. Depending on the position of the arms, there are different types of angles. Let's learn about them. The angle lies between 0 degree to 90 degree is less than 90 that is called acute angle. Acute angle? No, it's acute angle. It's less than 90 degree is called acute angle. If the angle lies sharply at 90 degree perpendicular, it's called right angle. All right. If the angle is greater than 90 degree but less than 180 degree that is called obtuse angle is less than 180 degree. If the angle lies sharply at 180 it have angle? Nothing there will be no angle. Wrong. It have some angle that is 180 degree. So it is called straight angle. The angle having 180 means that is called a straight angle. If the angle is greater than 180, less than 360, that angle is called reflex angle. If the angle having full complete rotation, it ends with a zero that we called as 360 degree. Zero degree? 360 degree? Yes, both are correct. If the angle is zero degree, the races are lies at the same line that we call the zero angle. If the angle is having full complete rotation is called 360 degree that why it is called as a complete angle. Let's have a quick review. If less than 90 is called acute angle, 90 degree is called right angle, is greater than 90 means obtuse angle, is 180 degree means straight angle, is greater than 180 means reflex angle, 0 angle degree means zero angle, 360 means is called a complete angle. Thanks for watching. Thank you students.